Howdy folks, welcome back to Medieval Dynasty. We've got a baby pig. Yeah, we finally got a baby animal. And it's a little piglet. Just saw it running around like, wait a minute. Yep, we got a little piglet. Look at that. <laughs> Pretty cool. And uh, last episode we unlocked the uh, sewing hut too. And I think the, whoa, hello. What's up, buddy? The, uh, was it woodshed too? So I was going to upgrade the sewing hood. It keeps getting... Oh, sorry, buddy. It keeps getting broken a lot. I had to repair it several times. So let's see if we can't get that updated. And I don't know what it's going to do with the NPC there. So let's just hit quick save real quick. And if we go to buildings, production, and we have a sewing hut too. We should be able to upgrade in place. I wonder if she's going to, like, temporarily leave, maybe? All right, so we have a wooden wall with door. I just got rid of all the compost bins. I've got some logs on. All right, so we need, what, 7, 17, 27, 32, it's about 36 logs. I think we've got plenty of logs. Not sure how we're doing on planks, though. What did I say? 37? Grab. Uh, I'm not going to be able to carry that many. Let's grab 30. We'll waddle back over there. Ugh. No, I was. I forgot to count those anyway. So that's going to be eight, ten, and then so another twelve logs. I think ought to do it. We're going to need some planks. L for log. About another twenty. I think there might be four sections of six. And this should be hopefully a lot more durable. I'll be breaking down all the time. Not enough freezer. Oh, I'm too short. I can't add, apparently. Interior is pretty much the same, it looks like. Short two logs. Little village is humming along. It takes a it takes a lot of work. Until you get everything just dialed in. One thing I noticed before when I was upgrading the production buildings, uh, it does away with your uh, production numbers, unfortunately. So I should have went and looked. I don't remember. Oh no, it didn't this time. Oh no, wait, it does away with the worker. That's right. Not the numbers, the worker. Uh, let's see. I think she was the one that was in the sewing hut. Sewing hut two. There we go. We got lots of kids. We got like five kiddos and three more on the way. <laughs> Gonna be growing up soon. All right, so she, she should be coming back to work. Uh, I'm going to die of thirst, so let's go grab a drink here real quick while wifey's not on the well. Like it might be uh, evening time? Yep. Everybody's wandering in and chilling. Kind of relaxing. I forgot to sell the pear juice when I was down there. Donkey, you can hang on to that. Need some actual food. Let's go check on our food situation. I just I dumped a bunch of meat in here from all the hunting I did. We got our carrot harvest in. We got our onion harvest in. We could actually make some nice stuff. We got all kinds of meat. All right. Well, let's have a look in our kitchen. 
And she's just been making roasted meat, but since we have stuff now, let's let's redo the recipes. Let her make stews and whatnot. So we'll bring that down and then stew from yeah, carrots. I think we've got meat with gravy. Meat with gravy with the onions and the Okay, so we will need to make some roast. Or I could just roast a bunch. Yeah, let's do that. There we go. Yeah, we unlocked. Oh, and I think while I was adventuring around, we unlocked the uh, the fold. I don't know if I showed that on screen. So we could get some sheep going at some point. Where's our oldest meat? The, uh, let's take that. And about a hundred of the sure. About that much of that. And I'll go ahead and roast that up myself. Have it available. And I think the level six cook has been pretty much keeping up. We'll see how it goes. See, do I have any dried meat? No, they ate up all the dried meat. Oh, we got our plum harvest in. Cherries in. Give me some, give me some plums to eat. Please give me just food. Give me a food and water. I might just fairly lightweight too. I might just carry those around as a snack, and then I'll uh, let me grab this dried meat. Dried fish meat. Yeah. Now I'm all good. So yeah, they got the or the uh, orchard harvested. The fields are looking good. I love that the farming just kind of takes care of itself. Now I have to make sure they've got. Tools and bags and seeds and whatnot. Uh, they did run out of uh, beet seeds. Go to... Where was it? Beets. That's not... Uh... Oh, I thought I had beets. I thought they got some planted, but they didn't. Okay. Well, my bad. I guess I need to buy some beets. I don't remember why I was getting beets. There was beets for a reason. I don't remember what that reason was. Nobody collects from the donkey shed, so we'll just do it ourselves. I don't think they collect even if <laughs> even if you have an animal breeder assigned there. Well, we'll throw that back in the old uh, coffers here. We're we doing on storage, by the way. We're doing good. All right. Excellent. Well, night's coming up. But I'm thinking of upgrading that one and maybe getting rid of this one. I think when you upgrade this. Can have more workers. That's how most of them work anyway. So let's go to buildings, production. Nope. Buildings, extraction, woodshed too. And what we need. A log and six planks. Well, that's easy enough. Look at that sunset. 
It is plentiful. One log, please. And six plank. Well, that was the easiest upgrade ever. <laughs> okay, so then if we go back to uh, who is so Huberta? You are not great at extraction, so I should not have you on there. You're pretty decent. I just put you on there. Oh, maybe you were on here. All right, let's do that. Uh, extraction. No, woodshed. Woodshed too. Yeah, we can put two people in here. Now, did it keep... Yeah, it did keep the settings. Okay, so we can move you to Woodshed 2. How do I do that? I got to remove. I want sand. Maybe I don't have to remove. Okay, we'll just have them both work there. And I'm thinking about getting rid of this, and maybe putting in some more houses up this way. So let's go ahead and get rid of this. destroy. Oh, there's something in the container. No. Oh. Two pieces of firewood, okay. Uh, destroy. There we go. And I'm thinking about putting a uh, house here. The house fit there though. Let me get rid of proper wood pieces. Here's a little baby. I don't think that's going to fit because of the tree. Okay. What if we got rid of this? Obstacles blocking. What obstacle is blocking? Oh, 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 we had it. Had it. We could do that. Can't get very close. Can't get very close to the other thing there. It's... Okay, fine. We'll do it that way. Not my favorite thing ever, but it'll do. But it is getting dark, so how dirty am I? Let's take a bath. I'm going to get some sleep and we'll resume building in the morning. Just talking to the wife here. How's your little kingdom doing? Everything's going smoothly. What's on your mind? She's been telling me this lately. Being good enough is the same as failing. I don't know what that means. Her affection's 100%. Mood's not bad. She says everything's going all right. Okay. Have a good day. Maybe because we haven't uh, decided to have a kid yet? I'm not sure. I mean, we could 
Could kick that off, but we'll probably make a whole episode around that. Let's go get this uh, house finished up. Be good to have an extra house. And we need to find some fellas with some skills. There's so many ladies around. It's hard to find the fellas. All right, we need some logs. So let's get rid of these other spruce trees here. I'll leave the stumps. Make sure the tree's not falling on me. Yeah, I know we have logs in there, but don't you worry. We're going to go grab some of those, too. It takes quite a few logs. Because up here by the uh, herbalist hut, I was thinking about making log cabin rather than stone. Six more logs. We're going to need a lot of logs, I think. Look at that. The village is coming along. Got all these wood roofs everywhere. We need to upgrade... Can I upgrade the... The, uh... Oh, I can upgrade the food. Alright, we need to do that. I haven't done that yet. Alright, give me some logs here. Bell for log. I found a straw hat. I think I forgot to show that off. Found a hat. So, got a cool hat now. It's not a Kerbo hat, but, you know, it's pretty close. And the idea would be that the, the road continues up through here. Like that. All right, and then we want a wall with window, and it's going to be a wood wall. Door. Beautiful. Wooden roof. It's kind of weird that you can do the roof in different types. I guess it gives you freedom, but would you really want you know, a th half thatch, half wood plank? All wooden, wooden. Yeah. Now we just need lots of logs. I'm going to do the interior because I always forget to do the interior. Oh. So we need uh, 12, 16, but we need 20 more logs and 24 planks, I think. I never noticed that chain hanging there before. That's kind of cool. Two smithies working away. Well, I'm, at, I'm going to turn that off. What did I say? 20, 20 logs. 24 planks. Something like that. And we're getting kind of low on logs. We need that uh, woodshed too to step up to the plate. I've been burning through stuff pretty quick. Building all these houses. There we go. House complete. And then to insulate this, we need dab, right? Lots of dab. Probably like 50 or 60 dab. 
don't know that I have any. I do have 11 daub. I believe that's made with clay and straw, which I've got my clay built up pretty good. I don't remember the recipe, sure. So let's grab. I think it's tens, maybe. So I think I grabbed too much clay. Try 60 of each. I don't have them making that in the horn. Maybe I should uh, dab. We'll see if 60 is enough to get that house insulated. Then I think I've got some, some limestone. Might be able to insulate some of the stone houses. The work just never ends. Now, I believe somebody said you can eventually have a builder in your village that will do these things for you. But I think we're a ways off from that. Add insulation. Yes, please. Hey, we're good. We had enough. A little short. I don't know. Uh, maybe you can let me know in the comments. What would be the purpose of insulating the workplaces? Like, does that does that matter? Does that do anything? What's up, pig? All right, we can put that back. And then, how are we doing on limestone? We got seventy three limestone. Just really up. I know as I was insulating these houses up here. Insulation, yeah. Finish off this stone house here. I believe that increases their satisfaction, their mood. There we go. So those two are insulated. Lots of baby noises in the village these days. And of course we got these down here. Let's start with the one that's closest to the road. Just because. Okay, everybody needs to work away and do their thing. <laughs> right, Piggy? There we go. We got the uh, the sewing hut upgraded. Got the new woodshed. So with two people there, one can be doing planks, one can be out cutting. Oh, and I picked up a perk. Hey, old friend. No, it doesn't work on her. Goodbye. Maybe it's uh, only certain ones. Like when I was talking to my wife, it showed me her uh, personality type. Hello there. Yeah, personality. Busy bee. Picked up a perk for that. Maybe that's only for people you're flirting with. I'm not sure. Have a good day. But anyway, I think that'll do it for this episode. Still lots to do. The adventure continues. Thanks as always for watching. I'll catch you in the next one. Yeah, we gotta get that thing upgraded. So much to do.